The Premier and our Health Minister are about to officially open Midland Hospital this morning. It's the first new hospital in the region in over 60 years. The $360 million facility will become the main hub for Perth's Eastern Corridor when Swan Districts closes. Nathan Curry is there now. Nathan, the hospital won't actually open its doors to the public until Tuesday. Yes, Lee, I just spoke to hospital staff a short time ago and they were quick to point out that anyone seeking medical attention should not come here until 7 o'clock on Tuesday morning. The public opening will coincide with the closing of Swan Districts after 60 years of service. Now, there is plenty of excitement happening here. The opening ceremony is expected to get underway in about 20 minutes and special guests have started to arrive. The new hospital is much bigger than Swan Districts. There's about 300 public beds and up to 70 private rooms. There was a bit of controversy surrounding the new hospital as it's run by the Catholic St John of God Healthcare. It won't offer services such as pregnancy terminations. Uh, the facility is desperately needed for Perth's Eastern Corridor. The area's population is expected to grow by about 40% in the next 15 years. It's also great news for local cancer patients. They've had to travel to the Fiona Stanley for treatment and that was about a 38 kilometre journey for them. Um, and as I said earlier, anyone seeking medical attention should not come here till 7 o'clock on Tuesday morning. Lee.